Hey guys, what's up? It's Eric Paul, and it's time for another hockey video, Hockey Tuesday, because I didn't make a video yesterday. Um, this time, the Calgary Flames are going to be facing the Colorado Avalanche, and George Seabrook is looking to extend Calgary's streak, its winning streak of, it's like 12 or 13 games. It's a huge winning streak right now. Um, but my biggest fear, and this is notorious in this game, programmed losses, where no matter what you do, if you win too much, your team will be kind of forced to lose a game here and there to um, set, you, set your team back down to earth. You're not really supposed to win that many games in a row. The game doesn't like that. Um... So anyway, I'm sure everybody knows about the Sacramento Kings deal with their imminent sale to that group. I'm just so done with all that. I really am. But you can see right here, they get two sim goals right away. Those were the first two sims I was on the bench. That was just... Oh my god, I was so mad when that happened. But I wasn't just going to stop because it didn't affect my stats. It didn't do anything to me. Um, right there, that was a great behind-the-net assist. Pass assist to Alex Tangay. And George Seabrook picks up his first assist of the game. Um, but anyway, with the Kings, um, my attitude with it right now is just sit back and wait and see what happens that's it if they go I mean worst case scenario I'll hate basketball at least NBA basketball and right there that goal that goal just that was not okay but uh what what are you gonna do you know I mean he basically moved his stick through the defender that that was garbage. I, I'm sorry. But um, right here, they pick up another simmed goal, so that's basically going to be it for this game. I don't see the Flames coming back, but we're going to try. Right there, an assist uh, for Matt. Oh, well, actually, did he score? Let me see here. Yeah, Mark Giordano actually scored. Um, so that that was really good. Yeah, usually the defenders don't score in this game, but but he's our best defender. So he'll he'll pick up some goals here and there. Um, so right here, Seabrook draws the steal, draws the turnover, and then. Drives down here. The defender's playing overly aggressive, so he has to turn back, shoot backhand. That doesn't work, even though that was a good shot. And then he scores. And George Seabrook picks up his first goal of the game. And his 39th goal of the season. That's good enough to be in first place at this point. About 47 games in. No, not that many. Um like 43 games in but um, unfortunately that's going to do it for the Flames they were all done scoring even though they outshot the uh, Avalanche by 11 it didn't even matter it was still 4-3 to three. so programmed loss I was pretty angry but what are you going to do just go back out and win that's all you can do you know, just play your best game. And, you know, Seabrook had a good game, too. So I, I guess I shouldn't be too disappointed. One assist and one goal. And he also rose his plus minus by two. Um, but anyway, I'm Eric Paul. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.